Hello everyone, Gadget Girl Kylie here, Horizon Zero Dawn is released! Well, it's not released, it's just that I'm allowed to stream it, but anyway, embargo has lifted as of about one minute ago, so I'm allowed to live stream it on my channel and I'm so hyped. A big thank you to Sarah from Sony once again for providing me with a copy of this game, but we need to dive in guys, we need to dive into Horizon. So... How is everyone doing? For those of you watching this on YouTube, don't forget I am live streaming this, so of course I'm interacting with my chat as always. I'm so, so hyped. So this first episode is going to be about 1 hour 30 minutes, guys, um, and then I've got to head off for tea, and then I will stream another one after I've eaten. Oh, it's so pretty! For information about this game, guys, don't forget to check down below in the stream or video description. He's got epic facial hair game. <laughs> What's that now? Don't like the cold? Oh! Can't stay in today. We have a ritual to perform, you and I. Tiny Baba! So small! <laughs> no! <laughs> Wear this. It belonged to my daughter. Oh Good. my gosh. Cute! <laughs> Today, I speak your name, girl. But will the goddess speak it back? Wow. It looks so nice. Baby's going on a trip. Baby's day Only out. <laughs> it would be the mother who declares. If you had one. The whole village would attend, and matriarchs perform the ritual. But we are outcasts. Even so, we keep the tribe's rituals. Otherwise, we might become like the faithless old ones who turned their backs on the goddess. But their wickedness doomed them. To us, were left the splendors of creation. Beasts of air, water, earth, and steel. There we are, the machines! One thing to hunt a beast, another to hunt a machine. You must be humble and respect their power. I will teach you this one day. <laughs> when you're not a fragile little cherub. <laughs> Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button, guys. We have a 100 like goal on every single video and live stream. Show support for Horizon Zero Dawn on the channel. The baby's just like <laughs> in awe of everything. Hi, Matriarch Tirsa. What is she doing here? Does she mean to forbid the ritual? No, 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 off your knees. It's nearly time. All right. And yes, you may speak to me. You came to bless the naming. Have not six months gone by since we entrusted her to you. But we are outcasts. You by choice. And she, well... <laughs> I am a high matriarch, Rost. I bless whom I choose. So <laughs> Damn are... straight, girl. Yes, yes, <laughs> go and be ready to declare. Go.
All mother, this child needs a name by which to know her. That your love may warm her life as the rising sun warms all the it's earth. It's like the start of the Lion King. Speak her name. <laughs> it is. Aloy. Aloy. Yeah. No, no, no. That's Pride Rock. <laughs> And so her name is blessed. Stop this at once! What have you done? I've blessed the naming of a child. Stubborn woman, you call that curse a child? What did she tell you about his birth outcast? Answer! I've done only what you asked. To raise it, yes. We said nothing of love. Enough. How can you not fall in love with a child you, you're raising? Bless you know. Name like it was one I know my duty to them. <laughs> and to you. Hello, welcome to the stream, everyone. I'm here. I'm just trying to focus on go. the story at the moment, so I'll look over at the chat in a sec. Well, I agree with... You know, the matriarch, it's like, okay, so he chose to be an outcast, but the child isn't. The child has been placed in his care, so it should go through the proper tribal rituals then. That's only fair. Screw you, old lady. <laughs> Silence. Right, let's have a look at settings, guys. So difficulty, we've got easy, normal, hard, very hard. Um, I'm gonna go with easy because I really just want to enjoy the story and apparently from what I've seen from articles and stuff It's kind of difficult this game. So I'm going on easy quest pathfinding on waypoint pathfinding On I guess hood always on that's fine Controls I'll just leave everything on normal audio on normal visuals favor resolution renders the game in 2160p checkerboard resolution super samples to your display resolution if your display does not support 4k favor performance renders the game with a smoother frame rate and with enhanced graphical features i want a smoother frame rate to be honest and i'm just gonna leave everything else on default is that saved yes okay new game here we go I'd already chosen easy. Oh, there she is! Aloy! At six years old. <laughs> this game is so pretty! Ooh, that's a lot of berries. Oh, look at her adorable You're little freckles. Together, aren't you, little Go and see if you can find some more, hmm? I wonder if she's allowed to play with the other children or not, or... Well done, that's a good boy. <laughs> children, come with me. Oh, no way! Seriously? She's an outcast to be shunned. I'll shun you, woman. There. Oh, come on. Sio says Aloy has the loveliest coloured hair. I know, right? See, how can you treat a child this way? It's gonna be a Gara story all over again. Shunned and feared. Grows up to want vengeance. <laughs> and people wonder why that happens. Nah, not Aloy. She's gonna prove herself, she's gonna be badass. Rost! Down here! Rost! Rost! He won't hear me. Okay. New main quest, a gift from the past. 
Oh great, my ultimate enemy. Cold, wet, and dark. <laughs> Ew, rats. Go into the cave. Wow, just look at it, man. It's beautiful. Can't climb up. Let's just press options a second. Settings. There we go. Favour resolution, so I can actually change it. Chris was telling me to change it, so... I'm doing it now. The lighting effects. Oh! Oh, God! Bounce! <laughs> We are almost halfway to the 100 light goal already, guys. Thank you so much for that support. It is greatly appreciated. So don't forget to Looks click the thumbs tight. up button to but support this through. game. Crouch. Oh, man. Hang on a second. There's, there's like, branching paths here. I want to have a look around and see... I think that- Whoa! <laughs> the anime girl says, why blame her? I know she's an outcast, but that's too harsh. I know, it's like... It's really horrible. An adult can understand the laws of a tribe, a but a child... One of the old places. A child probably thinks it's stupid and isn't going to fully understand why they're being treated that way. Lazy Gamer says, Hi GGK, I've been watching all your YouTube videos and now I'm finally catching you on the live stream. Thank you, Lazy Gamer. Everyone, welcome Lazy Gamer in the chat. Welcome, welcome. This place is scary. Like, if I was a child and I fell down here, I'd just curl up in a ball and wait to be saved. <laughs> It'd be like, hell no. <laughs> Oh, I saw something then, in the water, I think. Unless the cave is playing tricks on me. <laughs> okay. I don't think there's anything to find as of yet. I think it's just pretty much go from point A to point B. Ross said no like this. The controller's shaking. To find a way out. have to find a way out. <laughs> Please, I don't want to die here. I'm just a small child with my life ahead of me. I'm too young to die. And of course, the moment I start streaming is the moment the dog at the back of the house starts barking. So hopefully you guys can't hear that. Ooh, what's that through there? It's pointy and it's shiny and I want to touch it. I want to give it a poke. A friendly poke. An exploratory poke. The best kind of poke. Right, upstairs we go. Oh my gosh. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, that scared me. Oh man. We're not going to come across a machine when we have no weapons and we are a small girl, are we? Surely not. There's something up ahead. Great. Absolutely great. Let's have a little bit of a peer through here. You see the light reflecting off the walls. There's so much detail on this game, guys. It looks great on my uh, TV. 
It looks lovely. Oh! I feel I feel quite jumpy in this cave, man. It's What's very that? atmospheric. A dead person. A dead person? What? Okay. Get ready for a corpse, guys. Warning you now, there's going to be a corpse. Something shiny there. Oh god. Don't touch the corpse. <laughs> Dylan says, surprise, it's actually a zombie game. We've all been tricked. <gasps> Whoa. Maybe that communicates with the machines or can control some machines? I don't know. <laughs> Forever says, no jump scares, please. Not in a cave. My heart can't take it, okay? Not in a dark place, please. Lights. Everywhere. Pretty. How does he do this? I'm in the Matrix. Oh, bunker door, blast door, heavily shielded. So it kind of like reveals information then. This is cool. I feel, I feel badass right now. A metal door, closed. Maybe this device I found can help. Maybe. Use the device to scan the room. A shape. It's connected to the door somehow. Use the hollow lock. So that's the hollow lock. Electromagnetic security mechanism with the standard holographic UI interface unavailable. So how do I get there then? Oh, this way. I see. That's so cool, guys. <laughs> Mike Rabbit says the most badass child ever. I've got the power of the Matrix. Eh, rap. <laughs> Actually, I don't know why I'm saying that. I'm not scared of rats. Rats get a bad rap, okay? Okay, I can't scan those. Oh, look, cool! The rat is glowing. Rats! <laughs> I can scan the rat! <laughs> That's so awesome. It's a shame it didn't have a description, though. A disgusting vermin that no one likes. Except Kylie. <laughs> It's okay, rat. I've got you back. Okay, turn hollow lock counterclockwise. Turn hollow lock clockwise. It changed color. Return to the door. Sweet! We opened it, guys. Nice work. What's this? What's this? What's this? Bunny Boy says, I like the blue and purple interface. Yep. It reminds me of um, Infamous. The neon powers. The door changed colour too. Open the door. 
Oh, what lies in wait? I did it. More cave. <laughs> of course, there's going to be more cave. The heck is that? Can't seem to interact with that guy, sadly. I just want to touch everything. <laughs> I'm a child. <laughs> I just want to poke everything and see what happens. Worry about the consequences later. Look at the way it's glowing on Aloy's head as well. That's so cool. See, um, by the way guys, like if you're new to my channel, I do really like to explore and examine as much as possible, so that's why I'm taking my time. Looking around and investigating, that's how you that's find that. the cool stuff. You think I want it this way? It's the best I can do. He's right behind you. <laughs> Happy Hologram? birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. But look, Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but we can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Show me. Show me again. I can do. He's right behind you. Hi. Hi. Mind blown. <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. Daddy can't be there with you and mom, but we can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. <laughs> wow. What's that? Just a data point. Okay. Bunker door. So it's another blast door then. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm guessing she's never seen that technology before. Obviously she knows about the machine wildlife but holograms must be new because of the way she reacted. I think this one is... Oh, squeeze through the gap. Yeah. <laughs> Eric says this looks gorgeous. I know, it is absolutely stunning. Trust me, I'm playing on my TV. Can't remember how big my TV is. Chris, how big is my TV? <laughs> is it 47 inches or is it... No, it's 42, isn't it? I downgraded size. But it's a way better TV than the previous one I had. And it looks stunning! Sio says Aloy has an innocent cuteness about her. Well, she is a child, isn't she? And, you know, this tech is definitely new to her. That's the impression I'm getting here. So... She's just so curious about it, but... Why did they die here? What happened to them? I mean, seriously. Record our thoughts for posterity. Great idea, Director Evans. Like, I haven't done enough for posterity already. Like, I wouldn't be here like this if not for posterity. I'm done with posterity. Posterity can go... F <laughs> can go... F Oh, come on, we can have a fuck. Can go fuck itself. There you go, I'll finish your sentence. Oh, okay, circle is roll. I just found that out. <laughs> but yeah, like... I'm guessing something bad's gonna happen with this that we're using right now, eventually. And Machu Picchu. Always wanted to see that. Never did. Why didn't I go with Owen when he asked? Stupid. Well. Oh, 
damn. Machu Picchu. Always wanted to see that. Machu Picchu. Always wanted to see that. And pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. I mean, uh, death. I'm sorry. It's been a while. Oh, these meds Johnny gave us are really something. So, uh, okay, from the top, kids. <clears throat> Hail Mary, full of grace. So, these are people that have been experimented on them. That's grim. Someone singing this really like morbid dark song before death. That just really gave me goosebumps all over my arms, guys. Lazy Gamer says this is pretty dark and I'm loving it. Definitely dark. But Aloy just seems to not care. <laughs> or at least right now. If you look at how some of these bodies are positioned, they're not they're not lying flat. Like that arm is kind of up. It makes me think that they died in agony and they were like rifing around, rolling around and flailing their limbs and stuff, because that's not normal, like you know. Curious, but also slightly scared. <laughs> Now, did I scan these ones or not? And pray for us. Sinner. Yeah, I've scanned that one. Is there any others over here or no? She's gotten further than I would have done at her age. I would have just been like, get me out of here, <gasps> crying in the fetal position. I hear you. I'm coming, last. Bunny Boy says, I think this kind of just confirms how the world came to be or what came before the apocalypse. I'll be right there! Oh, mother be praised. Come, girl. Take my hand. 
you don't belong down there. <laughs> yeah, I definitely don't belong down there with all the corpses. Such places are forbidden, Aloy. I fell in. They are of the metal world. What is that on your face? Nothing. It's just some jewelry. You don't understand, Did okay? You find it down there. No. Give it to me. No. Aloy, such things are dangerous. No. You're not my father! <laughs> it's mine. Well, if you're gonna go sneaking away from home, you'll need to know how to survive in the wild. Come, Aloy. Yes, time to train and become a badass bitch! You will learn to hunt. Ian says they have such lovely shiny faces. I think that's because of the wet caves. Their faces aren't normally shiny. <laughs> or at least I don't think so. They weren't. There we go. It's not shiny there. So it was from the dampness of the cave. Wow. I'll be shaking. What do they mean? Take your bow. So I'm guessing Rost can't see that then. You can only see it if you've got the device on and active. Bow. <laughs> In case you didn't know what it was. Plaything. We descend to the valley now. Follow. The wilds can be dangerous, Aloy. You will need to stay close and do as I say. Yeah, definitely. No. I mean, now, look at him. You're still scratched He's up hench. from that fall you took yesterday. <laughs> so let's start there. Take this medicine pouch. I'll show you how to fill it. See this plant over here? It's called South Brush. Lesson of the Wild, follow Ross. Gather its berries in your pouch. Oh, look at the way she runs. It's dead adorable. Aloy, come now. Gather the All berries. Alright, chill out. Give me a second to admire the scenery. You're not my dad. I told you. <laughs> Gather the berries. Okay. I just wanted to look around at the pre. Chill out. Good. Now eat the berries. Okay, press up on the D-pad to transfer health from your medicine pouch to your health pool. <laughs> <laughs> they may taste bitter, but they can save your life. Always keep your pouch full of medicinal berries, flowers, and plants. Where are we? This valley is just a part of All Mother's embrace. Embrace. The Nor tribe watches these lands and keeps out the most dangerous machines. Usually. Usually. Keyboy says, did you notice the ants on the trees then? Oh, I missed that. Such detail in Further this game, down river, though. We'll find a herd of machines, and I will teach you how to hunt. Are they dangerous? All machines are dangerous, Aloy. Their power must be respected. But I will be beside you. My gosh, this game, guys. This game is stunning. Dakishson says he's starting to sound like Bill Cosby. <laughs> Aloy, a machine's coming. Crouch and follow me into the tall grass. Okay. Yes, Rost. Yes, Master Rost. Oh ho ho. There. Now stay low. No, Aloy. Such machines are called watchers. You must learn to avoid their gaze. If you are to survive in the wilds, I will show you. Listen closely and do as I do. Stay still. Wait for it to pass. Somebody's watching me. Now, <laughs> Follow me across the trail to that tall grass. Oh, another one. Let it pass. 
us. <laughs> Twisted said, Kylie, he's still angry about the headpiece you're wearing. Do you think it's wise to disobey and look at the pretty? And crouched walking is quieter than upright. Yes, I do. Come on now. He has no authority over it. me. He's not my real dad. <laughs> like I'm gonna listen to him. <laughs> Renoa says it's like a mechanical velociraptor. That's the last of them. Let's move I said on. mechanical really weird then. Mechanical. Like Machine Draymon. <laughs> Did well. Thank you. I didn't you. see or hear you. Now stay close. That herd should be just ahead. Okay, so the eye symbol indicates how visible you are. Cool. Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> the pretty is so nice. The way Aloy runs is just adorable. Look how she's not even lifting her legs up that high. <laughs> Whoa, that dude can climb. Who's that? Kane says, Ignore wow, that him. grass physics, though. But why is he up there? He's a badass. Hello, monkey boy. He's smiling at us. Deb, get back where you belong. Deb, get back Sorry. where you belong. Ignore him. We are outcasts and he is of the tribe. Maybe he doesn't like to try. Then he is a fool. What, you mean like you? Let's find you that chose herd. to be an outcast Fall. yourself? Maybe he chose to be an outcast so he could raise Aloy because not having a mo mother makes her a curse. I don't know, maybe that's why he's an outcast, is because the only way for her to be raised was for him to become an outcast? I don't know. If so, then he is awesome and he stepped up to the plate. He took one for the team. Because the rest of the tribe were dicks. Yeah, if the mum dies in childbirth, what we'll do is we'll basically say this child is a curse and uh, yeah, we don't want none of it. Can I gather this or... Oh, nice. I'll have me some of that. And as always, we got stuck on 69 likes, guys, because you were all dirty-minded. <laughs> there. See them? These are called striders. So don't forget to hit that thumbs up button, guys. As always, we have a 100 like goal on every single video and stream on the channel. It is greatly appreciated ah, and direct support. Shows me you, you want more Horizon on the channel. <sighs> Show you how some machines startle easily if they detect you and run away. They're best approached by stealth. Don't worry. We'll catch up with them further down the valley. You'll see. Now, I want you to find some rocks that fit the cup of your hand. Why? Do as I say, Aloy, and gather the rocks. I will show you how to use them. Good. It's time That's to it. rock and roll. <laughs> Boodum. Those will do. Follow. Follow. He's very blunt, isn't he, really? I'm tempted to gather stuff as I go because obviously that gives me a bit of a head start. I'm guessing. Not unless they, they don't carry over. There's going to be an age jump, isn't there? Oh! Okay, so that's actually the run. Which is adorable. Aloy, come now. I don't know where you are. You've run away. Stop wasting time. No! <laughs> oh, look at that, guys. Damn. Aloy, come it's now. Lightning. <laughs> So what do you think of this game Aloy, so far, guys? Let me know in the stream chat. 
I'm loving it so far. Stop wasting time. I'm coming. Stop wasting time. Not my father. There's the herd. All right. It's time to throw some rocks. But rocks can't hurt machines, right? No, but they can distract them. Draw them into traps. Sweet. Like that watcher over there. They must be dealt with, or it will warn the herd and send them running before we get in range. Warn them? How? The machines speak to each other, Aloy. Like an Unless alarm they are system. First silenced. Now you stay here on the ridge. On my signal, throw rocks and draw the watcher over to me. Wait for my signal. I really like it, says Barry. Loving it, Kylie, says John. Thumbs up, says Sega Master. I want it so pretty, says CLM. Right, throw rocks to lure the watcher to rust. Stay on the ridge. Throw rocks Aloy, near rust. Throw rock near me. Throw a rock to draw the watcher towards me. Throw a rock to draw the watcher towards me. Press L2. What? Hey, Press L2 L to cancel throw. Me. So how do I throw it? Throw a rock to draw the watcher towards yeah, me. Yeah, it won't, won't let me throw it though. While holding down, aim the rock Throw off rock at your destination. Release. Me. Oh, okay. Release it. There we go. I was being an idiot. <laughs> I wasn't reading the instructions. Bunny says, looks so good so far. I can't wait for the combat. Rock, so hey, line. Throw a rock near me. Well, where are you? Did I throw it in the wrong? Oh, hey, I threw it in the wrong place. Fucking hell. <laughs> I threw it in the wrong place. There we go. Derpy derp. Oh, nice. Lost taking care of business. Yeah, I was being a derp there, guys. I'm sorry. You all know there. this about me. Come, girl, it's safe now. I can be a derp sometimes. I apologize. <laughs> right, so run down the safe way. We're not gonna just jump off the cliff. We're not badass yet. Got to be patient for badassery. That comes later. Harvest a kill so I can teach you how to make arrows. When near a dead machine, hold triangle to harvest it. So we got metal shards and we got Harvest sparker. a kill, Aloy. Pay attention. Use the stalks as arrow shafts and metal shards for arrowheads. Hold L1 to open the weapon wheel. Okay. Using R and press and hold X. There we go. Good. You'll never run out of arrows if you know how to craft what you need. Let's put those arrows to use. Follow. Right, okay. Me and aiming are normally not friends. So let's see how this goes, guys. <laughs> Remember, I don't play shooting games. So my aiming isn't Here. exactly amazing, usually. And I don't know how sensitive it is yet. First kill, the Strider. One of the weaker machines, but even a weak machine can kill a hunter if she's careless. You must study your brain. Its hide is thick, but there are spots where it is vulnerable. Like its eye. Can you guess another?
Oh, it's back. Blaze canister, weakness. And then also it's eye. The canister on its back. Is that a weakness? Yes. How did you guess that? The device. It showed you. Ah, see? That plaything? See? Stop playing games. Magical hairpin now, for the take win. Take down that strider. <laughs> Target the eye or the canister. And if it charges, be ready to roll out of the way. Right, hang on a second. It said notebook in the bottom right. So machine catalog. Strider. Heard machines that will bolt when disturbed, so they must be dealt with silently or quickly. Oh, and it tells you what loot you can get from them as well. That's interesting. Nice. Took care of business. You did well today, but you have much to learn. Tomorrow, we train again. Sweet. What was that? What? That boy. The one running the brave trails. Follow Eloy. Quick. Oh god! I fell! <laughs> I fell between the slippy stones! <laughs> Ian says, It's like bow and arrows against a friggin' metal magic dino. How are they not dead yet? Super arrows, I guess. I might have to change the sensitivity, though, of the aiming. I think it was a little too fast for me. <gasps> no! Oh, sugar. Oh, man! Oh, no! He's gonna get ganked. There's gonna be gank guys! As always on the GGK stream, there's gank. <laughs> I can do nothing. It's only a matter of time before the machines find that boy and kick him to death. But if I shoot, it will cause a stampede and it will trample him. But I can see the paths they take. Stop telling stories. Why won't you believe me? I'm not. I can sneak through. You will not. Oh! And now I've not got my bow. Seriously? Guys! Guys! <laughs> Shit's about to get real. I'm gonna use my digitary doodaddy device thingy. To save the day. When the watcher is scanned, press R1 to tag its control path. Okay. I need to do this slowly and quiet. Target R2. Right, so basically I want to do one at a time, don't I? I 
I'll wait till it buggers off more to the right and then I'll go behind that rock. I suck at stealth so it's going to be interesting to see how this goes. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up button on this stream and video guys. As always we have a 100 like goal on every single stream and video. It greatly supports the channel and me as a YouTuber. Plus it also shows me that you guys are enjoying this game and you want more of it on the channel. So how am I supposed to get past this without being spotted? Can I go behind it? I don't think I can go this way, actually. No, I can't go this way. Just Oh no. Just what you saw me. Did it? <gasps> okay, I died. <laughs> Let's do that again. So don't go left, apparently. I'm supposed to go directly ahead, aren't I, into that patch of grass? That's what I'm supposed to do. Can't let them see me. Go, go, go! Got to be careful. Right, okay. Wait till it turns around and starts walking back and then head to that other patch of tall grass. Man. Okay, he's gonna walk back and then I'll head for this patch. <laughs> Ian says, can't let them see me, but then continues to break every stick in sight. I've got to gather at the same time, right? There's nothing wrong with that. So is he gonna follow me back the same way? I'm waiting. It's better to be patient than risk it. I'm gonna wait till he's buggered off again. Is 
Because I'm amazing, that's why. Yes! We did it, guys! That was okay. Trophy followed Rost's teachings. Do you believe me now, Rost? Do you believe me now? So, it is no plaything. Mm, it's not just a hair accessory. Wait. Oh, Mother, bless that girl. Bless you both. Oh Boy. no, here we go. Save me. I just wanted Boy! Seal your lips. No talking to the cursed. They are outcasts both. And she is motherless. So? Well, not so, but you know what I mean. Like, Come now. you know, she's still being raised Back by Orson heart. Rost. And you. Boy should not have spoken to us. It's against tribal law. Well, we saved his life, so I think we kind of deserved at least we'll a thank now. you. <laughs> Follow. I know the way. Stay away, no mother. You Ooh. little shit. Yeah. Fuck you, dickhead. Throw it back. Flashpoints offer moments of emotional choice. How Aloy expresses her personality is up to you. Choose the fist, and Aloy will confront the challenge directly. Choose the brain, and Aloy will use her insight to find a clever... I didn't even get to see it. And then drop the rock as the, like... I don't know. Oh, I'm annoyed, though. Like, that hit her on the head. She's actually bleeding from that. Let's go with the, like, in-the-middle choice, I guess. Haha. Oh. -ha. Yeah. Away from there. Back to picking berries. What would you have guys chosen? Um, I said that really weird. What would you have chosen there, guys? Let me know in the chat or the comments section. Here, hold still. I'll get it. Why? Shh. Why am I an outcast? Aloy, this is not the time. Who was my mother? Aloy, I've told you before. That's not for us to know. You were just a newborn when the Matriarchs brought you to me. So the Matriarchs, they know? <sighs> it's not I so I want simple. answers, I'm sorry, but I do. But they know. Aloy, we are outcasts. So how do I make them tell me? The Matriarchs? There is a way, perhaps. So tell me. It would be dangerous. How? It would take years of training. I don't care. How do I do it? Oh, <laughs> look at the way she was pouring the at him then. The tribe's rite of passage held every year. Those who pass become braves. But to the one who wins, the matriarchs grant a boon. A boon? Yes, whatever the winner wants. Nice. Then I'll do it. Nice. <laughs> whatever it takes. I'll win the proving. <sighs> <laughs> Lots of different answers about the choice with the rock the there. Started, Quite a few people saying knock the hard. rock out of his hand, which is what It'll I went for. Start training. Same as you, Kylie. Yes. Be nice, says Kareem. Throw a boulder, says Robert. I don't think she's quite strong enough to throw a boulder. <laughs> Sweet. So after this is probably going to be the jump in age, isn't it? And then we get to see Aloy when she's older. And play as Aloy when she's a badass and she has all these training skills. 
Keyboy says, same choice for me. Let's read more of those choices while this cutscene's on. Use your brain, think of an idea, says the anime girl. No revenge, be nice, says Kareen. Throw the rock at them, says Tyler. <laughs> Some Phoenix says, I aim for the eye, aim for the head. <laughs> oh my god, some of you are so mean. My initial thought straight away was to throw the rock back though, to be fair. But after I calmed down, I was like, no, let's not be as bad as they are. Chris says, training montage! like goal guys don't forget on every single stream and video we have a goal of 100 likes so support horizon on the channel with a thumbs up now it is greatly appreciated as always so thank you to every single person that does that it really helps me out as a youtuber oh that was nice she she rolled and her roll was so amazing that she jumped a few years like she aged <laughs> Her role has like ta time jump powers. <laughs> that was nice. That was a really nice transition. And she's sexy. She's pretty, she's sexy, and she's badass. Look at this man. Yeah! Oh -ho -ho! Didn't need you. Didn't need you. Aloy in the house. <laughs> CO says Aloy when she's older is quite hot. Wow, says Bo. Rost. And the voice actress is the same one that did Chloe for Life is Strange. Rost. In case you are recognizing Rost! the voice and you can't place it. Where is he? Two days before the proving and he goes off without me? He wouldn't do that. Nice. Got some skill points. Max health plus 20. Press to unlock. Okay. So silent strike. Press R1 to perform a silent takedown on small machines and humans or deal high damage to medium enemies. Hunter reflexes. Time slows while aiming during a jump or a slide. Oh my god. <laughs> so we've got to aim when sliding? I'm going to be bad at that. I'm calling it now. I'm going to be bad at that. Silent drop. Landing from a fall or jump is completely silent and will not alert otherwise unaware enemies. Brave. While aiming, toggle with the R3 button to... Well, not button. You know what I mean. R3. Pressing in the analog to slow down time. I'm gonna go for that if I can because that will help me with my bad aiming skills or lack thereof aiming skills <laughs> Dylan says oh dang my kid's sister would love this because she loved the life is strange and really liked that voice actress King Toby says, this is like the female version of Link. Right, okay, so what's this one? Critical hit, press R1 for a high damage attack on downed enemies. That's pretty nice as well. Learn that. Um, light spear attacks have an increased chance to knock off armor and components. Use... I don't know what that is. From the tools menu, to lure a single enemy to your position, the target will be the closest most centered to Aloy's view. Speeds up healing from the medicine pouch. Um, additional natural resources when foraging. That's pretty nice. That's a good start bonus. I'm going to go for that. So out of all of these guys, which ones would you have gone for out of the top row? Let me know in the comments section of the video and on the live stream. Hello Gate Gaming, welcome to the stream. In fact, welcome everyone to the stream. We've got so many people watching right now. I appreciate the support, guys. Find Rost. Cool, let's just take a moment to 
take in the scenery though and have a look around. Meat! Team Meat, guys. We know this from my Digimon Let's Play. Digimon World Next Order. Team Meat hashtag get it going in the live chat. <laughs> oh, I wanted to scan it. <laughs> I wanted to see what it said. That's a shame. It's so bizarre to see like bits of machine and then like nature all around. The snow's got a bite out here. Oh man, it's making me hungry for some meat. <laughs> Why do I want meat? Oh, look at this. This is cool. Training dummy. Use R1 for a quick light attack, which can knock off armor plates. Use R2 for a slow heavy attack, which has a chance to knock down the target. Well, I destroyed the dummy. I'm sorry, no one else can train now. You don't need anyone else. I'm Aloy and I'm badass. <laughs> <laughs> Loads of people hashtagging Team Meat in the chat there. CO says, Kyloy? <laughs> yes, I am now Kyloy. <laughs> Your spear can knock off machine armor using R1. Try it on the training dummies. I've already done this, but I'll do it again because obviously, you know, just to get rid of that text. You can also knock over small machines by using R2. Yeah. We light the fire! Ooh, manual save. Okay, so this is how we save the game, which is good. Pretty darn useful. Save these for the trail. Yay, we hit the light goal! I'll have to change the target on Nightbot now, guys. There we go. Thank you so much for the love and support, guys. It does mean a lot. I appreciate every single thumbs up from you all. It helps support me as a YouTuber and streamer, and it shows me that you guys are really loving this game on the channel, and it means I will focus on it. In fact, I'm going to be focusing on it for, like, the next few days, so make sure you show some support. How's the game, says Tatara? It's He's awesome so far. This morning. Why isn't he here? Where's he gone to? I'm really loving this game so far. It feels so nice. So, so nice. What's he doing up there? He's gonna use the zip line. It's gonna be awesome. I say wanna use that right now. <laughs> He's just standing there. What's going on with him? Okay, how do I? Rust. Oh, jump, jump his axe, okay. I would have thought it would have told me a prompt on the screen, but never mind. Aloy, you're here. Is everything okay? Why the hold up? Good thing I know how to track. Is everything okay? Did you want to be alone? No. We must speak. But I've been thinking about your training, Aloy. You've learned to hunt, learned to survive. But I fear there's a lesson I failed to teach you. Okay. Would you learn it now? Of course. I'll always learn what you have to teach. There has been some trouble recently. It affords an opportunity to learn this lesson, but it will be dangerous. You must come prepared, or you will die. Oh, well, God damn it, Ross. We've only just started Descend playing this game. Descend into the embrace <laughs> and hunt until you've gathered the parts for fire arrows. 
fire arrows. What kind of trouble are we talking about? Once you have the parts, you will meet me there, at the gate beyond the village of Mother's Heart. Uh, the North Gate? At the edge of the Embrace? Yes. Now be on your way. Is something else bothering you? Anything else? I'll get the parts. Let's go with, is something else bothering you? Is something you? else bothering you? No, I'm fine. Are you worrying about what happens after the proving? What happens is clear. You will be accepted as one of the tribe and I will still be an outcast to be shunned. Oh, That's yes. not Even fair. Even if the tribe accepts me, I won't. There is much to do, Aloy. We will discuss this later. <sighs> okay. Right, so hang on a second. Let's just break that down a minute. So, if she succeeds, she is accepted automatically because she's proved herself. So, I'm actually wondering that what she will actually ask for is for Rost to no longer be an outcast instead. That she will ask for him to be accepted. Or perhaps that's going to be a choice that we are allowed to make instead. Because if that's the case, I'm very tempted because Rost has raised Aloy from a child and taught us all this stuff and yeah we kind of owe him really and it's not fair so I might go with that choice if it's offered but we shall see anything else you want me to do while I'm down in the embrace oh odd grotto might be out of food by now you could hunt a week's worth of meat for her, if you find the time a week, week's when worth I, of meat, damn. I should say thanks just once. Grata follows the law. Her science towards us is honorable, not an insult. If you say so. I'll go gather the parts, but I'm also going to pay Karst a visit. Aloy, that man breaks the law every time he speaks to you. And I'm glad he does. I want to buy a trip caster, and no other trader will sell to outcasts. Stock it with ammunition, then. You'll find use for that weapon tonight. That sounds ominous. <laughs> well, yeah, just a little All bit right. ominous. See you at the North Gate. Damn. I don't know, I want to learn about Aloy's mother, but equally, if it gives us a choice between learning about Aloy's mother and Rost no longer being an outcast, that's going to be a very hard decision to make. Am I just supposed to jump? That was awesome. Okay, open the map. Right. Strider site. We've got different fires located around. So that's cool that it shows us where the save points are. I like that. Right, quests active. So we've got a few different ones here. Talk to Cost and trade for a trip caster. He may have other items worth trading for as well. Trade for a trip caster. Craft fire arrows. So it looks like they're both kind of on the way. So that's good. Have any of you guys ever been on a, on a zip line? I have. But I ended up bashing my head. <laughs> when I got to the bottom, which wasn't good. The embrace. My whole life I've never gone beyond this valley. That'll change after the proving. Two days. Two days until I get answers. Two days and I'll know who she was. And why I was cast out at birth. As if there could be an excuse for that. All right, time to gather the parts for some fire arrows. I should find a herd. Right, let's manual save. Sio says, apparently when you're on the map, there is a semi 3D effect if you rotate it in a certain way. Oh, I see. 
I see. That's really cool. Thank you for pointing that out, CEO. That's badass. I like that. Nice. Paul says, fun fact for fans of Attack on Titan, Aloy's VA also voices Sasha. Also, hey everyone. Hello, welcome to the stream. Haven't been on a zip line, says Dommy Gamer. Kingy Toby says, zip lines are fun as heck but scary at the same time. Yeah. I'm scared of heights, so it was like a really intense experience for me going on a zip line. Wow, what's this? What's this? What's this? That's cool. What's this supposed to be? Oh, I can't scan it. I'm guessing you can only scan machine stuff then. Or living things. Because we scanned a rat. Mother's heart. Two more days, and I'll know what it's like in there. It's so many people crammed into one place. I guess no one ever gets lonely in there. Well, I can't scan him. Will he talk to me? I have nothing to say to an outcast. But I will walk into you and merge with your face. If I stay here long enough, you will talk to me. <laughs> I'll, I'll just be really annoying until you talk to me. CJ Escogomi, I can't even say your name. Hello, GGK. I love watching your videos and live videos, and I might get the game either on the PS Store, PS4 Store, or at GameStop. It's awesome. I'm loving it so far. I'm loving it, loving it, loving it. Right, mother's watch, so let's just have a look a second. Hunt for blaze shards, and then this one is talk to cast, right? So hunt for blaze shards is actually closer. So I'm just going to put a waypoint on that. Oh, there's so many, like, I really want to branch off and explore, but I don't think I should do that just yet. I think I should focus. There's a watcher over there. I'll tuck that away. There's actually a few of them, there's three of them here. How many can you tag at once? Is it only one? Oh no, I can tag multiple ones as well. me. 
Will they know I'm here or not? I think I was spotted. I think that one on the far right spotted me. So they've got... That's interesting. That shows me that they have got quite a long range. Oh my gosh, look how close they are. Just go about your business. That's right, boys. Bugger off, please. <laughs> okay, what's up here then? Oh my god. No. <laughs> Shit. Chris says, can't get over how pretty come. this game is. I was hoping there was going to be a zip line over here or something, but there isn't. So. Have they lost interest yet? I think they're still uh, searching. Uh. Oh no. I think I've been spotted, guys. If I hide here, they might not see me. No. Shit. Shit! <laughs> oh, bugger! Go, 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 go. to hide okay man I'm not good at stealth as you may have guessed right okay guys well it's time to stop this stream because shortly I will be having tea but I'm just gonna have uh, maybe like a hour break and then I'm gonna be back streaming so don't forget to stay tuned to my Twitter which is linked down below in the video description I'm gonna be streaming this a lot over the next three days so make sure you look out for those tweets and uh, yeah hopefully I will see you guys there but anyway if you haven't done so already don't forget to click the thumbs up button it greatly supports me as a youtuber and streamer 
Plus, it shows me that you guys are enjoying Horizon on the channel and you want to see more. And perhaps if you haven't done so already, consider joining Team GGK and clicking on that subscribe button. Also, if you bell me, bell me brah, <laughs> you can turn on notifications for my channel and that way you won't miss any video uploads or live streams moving forward. But anyway, guys, I'm going to go ahead and stop this stream here. I hope to see some of you again in the chat later on on the next streams. Take it easy and bye-bye.